Hi everyone, it's my third year colouring anniversary and I have a fun tag for you. I would like to see how many bees you have coloured. Just a fun look through your collection and count the bees coloured. Anyone is welcome to join in the tag. Just tag me in your video with the hashtag how many bees colouring and use the at be cosy so I may see your pages. There is no time limit and definitely no pressure, just fun. Thank you to Doodle Robot for the fun tag request. I've gone through my collection, so let's see how many bees I coloured.
Okay, so I have a couple of PDFs that I have coloured. This one was by Chris Cheng. It's called Easter Colouring. You can go to her Etsy store and buy it there. She also has a wonderful colour along. So I followed it. Use Prisma colour pencils. And we have our B. So that's one B on that page. And the other one I have is also a colour along. This was with Zucchini Kitty. And I believe it came from the Innocence book by Rachel Mintz. So it's just pencils, some inks, a little fun colour along. I'm counting her as a bee. That's another bee to the collection. But it's not a competition, it's just fun. It's a, it's a nice look back to see what I've coloured in the last three years. And it's going to be nice seeing what you've coloured as well. I'm very much looking forward to your pages and seeing how you've done. Another favourite, Daydreams by Anna Carlson. This is for next month's Colour Along with Doodle, Doodle Robot and Friends. So this is the March page that they've decided and it's got it's four B's on this page, so it should be fun. Let's see how everyone does on that one. Great timing. So that's daydreams. Okay, hey, so I thought I would show you some examples where I know some of you have done some lovely pictures in these books. Nature mandalas. This is one I haven't even started yet, and I mean to. So maybe you have. So it'd be great to see your pages. So that's a lovely mandala with the bees. So that's by Mel, and also by Mel. We have Enchanted Earth. You may have done this page. This is another one that I keep meaning to do. So I'm hoping to get round to it. This is your B. And another one by Mel. Circle of Life. These two fabulous pages. Again, I keep meaning to get round to these. I've seen loads of lovely examples. So please do share us your lovely work. We want to see your artwork. Some more examples. I managed to find one in here. And we have Millie Marta, Woodland Wild. She has this fabulous fella. It has the name of it in the back. So it's a tree bumblebee. These are all good examples. I might get round to that one day. Another one by Kirby Rosanz in Anamorphia. We have a double page spread. Maybe some of you have done this one. Anamorphia. And we have Johanna Basford's Worlds of Wonder. This is a very popular page. 
And again, I haven't got around to it, but I am really hoping to. This is high on my list. And it'd be great again to see in your collection whether you've done it. We have another Johanna Basswood. I mean, this is so amazingly popular. Come on, guys, you surely have done some bees in this book. There's loads of them. I haven't started many in here yet, so this is another page I'm hoping to get around to. Wonderful character. Maybe you have this in your collection and you've coloured something. Cute hedgehog colouring book. And it's by Vanessa, I believe. Shall we see? Yeah. It's by Vanessa Alex. You may have coloured this one. This I should really have on my to-do list because it's a new book and I am hoping to colour new books this year as much as possible. This is another new book for me. It really should be on my wish list to finish this page. These lovely little bees, honeycomb. Maybe you've done this one. So maybe you have this in your collection because it's been very popular again. I keep saying popular, but it, this really was very, very hot last year. It's a frog's tail. And there's a bee on the page. Maybe you have done this page. Maybe you found some others. So that's by RJ Hansen, who also did Night Garden. Now, come on. <laughs> You've definitely been showing me these pages on Instagram and YouTube. Don't be shy. Come on, show us your bee pages. This is Homeward Bound with the honey in the beehive. Yeah. RJ Hansen. Not sure if these count. What do you think? Lost and found RJ Hansen. Found this little fella here. I think that's probably a bee on opposites attract. Pretty cool. But this one, the bug catcher. Not sure if they're wasps or bees. What do you think? Maybe that one, not sure. Anyway, I'll leave that up to you. Now this is an unusual one. I haven't coloured in this one yet. Fairy Celebrations by Clara Markova. And I don't know what you make of this, but you may have done this. There's some little bees there and they're carrying pollen. But this one caught my eye. They're in a little bee costume. And maybe you've done that one as well. Book. How about some Camellia Angel Cova? 50 Easter and Spring Fairy Houses. This is a fun jolly book and we find a couple of bees with a beehive. Yeah, I think that's going to go on my to-do list for this year. Maybe you've already coloured it. And another Camellia Angel Cova book, 50 Space Theme Miniatures. This one's really fun. They're space bees collecting space pollen. <laughs> Again, you might have coloured it, you may not have done, but it's just an example. 
I have a PDF to share. This is Mario Labudek's free B page. I think she had about four or five images. I think I found it through Instagram somehow. Uh, I think she has a Facebook page and I downloaded it that way. You might still be able to find it. So I guess I'm colouring this one sometime this year. Grab it while you can. Perhaps you may have this one in your collection. Backyard Nature by Dot Barlow. Dover colouring book. These are your honeybees. This is an uncoloured book. And I also have the absolutely gorgeous Wild Flower Folk by Christine Caron. This page is amazing. This is on my to-do list when I'm brave enough, when I'm feeling up to it, but I have seen absolutely glorious works coloured in. Wonderful. Here's your little bee. The flower year. Another lovely book. And I looked all the way through and look, there's one bee at the back. <laughs> That's Lila Dooley. Another one for people who like nature colouring. It's the posh colouring book inspired by nature, Marjolaine Bustin. Beautiful. And we have Mythographic Paradise. It's been really lovely looking through all my work and art pages and my collection and we have bees lots and lots of them so if you have colored this which I have seen recently some of you have it's gonna be good and that's by Fabiana Atanasio I am planning to follow Karen Valentine's Honey Colour Along on YouTube. You may find Karen's PDF on her Etsy store. Links are in the description. A Million Baby Animals by Lulu Mayo. I think it's one of her cutest yet. And I found some bees. <laughs> Little bees with the deer page. So sweet. And a little hedgehogs at the bottom is a bonus. But yeah, three bees on that page. That's definitely going in the to colour pile. I hope you've had fun with that and really looking forward to seeing all your pictures. Let's tally up and count to see how many bees I coloured in my three years of colouring. I used a spreadsheet to help me count and I coloured a total of 264 bees. I coloured more bees than I thought as I do not tend to gravitate towards colouring them. It has taken me a year to put this hashtag video together. 
I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did making it. Looking through my colouring book collection is one of my favourite things to do, especially hunting for prompts. Some of my favourites to colour were the watercolour pages, also Yuri's Sketch Mouse, Hannah Carlson's Seasons, Kirby Roseanne's Fragile World, the Mini Mania series, and In Love. If you wish to see art supplies used, please check out my completed pages video playlist. Thanks again to Doodle Robot for the video request. Channels mentioned will be in the description. If you are sharing your pages, please tag me. I'm looking forward to seeing all your pages and your varied book collections. Be cosy. Friends and I, thank you for watching. If you got this far into the video, please leave a B icon in the comments below. Have a colourful time and happy colouring. Thank you for being here.